so rare condition this day and age to read any good news on the newspaper page and love and tradition of the grand design some people say it's even harder to find well then there must be some magic clue inside these gentle walls cause all I see is a tower of dreams real love bursting out Jamie Monet Foxworth was born on December 17, 1979. She's an American and pornographic actress, best known for her role as Judy Winslow, the youngest daughter of Carl and Harriet Winslow, on the hit ABC CBS sitcom Family Matters. I'm really getting sick of this. I want to swim that meal and I want it now. Okay, here, take this. This is junk mail. Hey, you're new in this profession. You've got to start at the bottom. I was born at the bottom. Better add zucchini to the shopping list. Z U K. Nope. Z O O K. Uh uh. Let's get corn instead. <laughs> Not much is known about her upbringing, but she did begin modeling at the age of five before she got the role of Judy. It seems like after the introduction of Steve Urkel, Fosworth's scenes were reduced dramatically. According to sources, the producers didn't have much for her role and because of budget cuts, they decided to let her go. It seemed as if producers really didn't care about her character to begin with. They didn't even bother to give her a proper send-off. There was no explanation as to why Foxworth's character disappeared. Producers continued the show as if her character didn't even exist. They went on to only acknowledge Eddie and Laura. There's so many cases where you wonder what happened to this kid. And it wasn't the kid's talent. It was the parent. You know, and I'm not blaming Jamie's mother. I'm not saying what she did was wrong or how she handled things is wrong. Um, but sometimes you have to be grateful um, that you have the opportunity uh, uh, to showcase your talent and wait for greater opportunities to come along. You know, and um, I, I feel that um, at the time, Jamie's mother felt that her character was being underserviced. And, you know, um, the, the producers took it as a slap in the face. And unfortunately, um, you know, it put Jamie in a very difficult position. With acting jobs slowing down for Foxworth after being kicked off the show, she formed an R&B group called She with her two sisters. They released their debut album, Be's the Charm, on July 1st, 1997 through Shaquille O'Neal's record label. In the early 2000s, she worked in the adult industry making pornographic films. Foxworth also battled substance abuse and depression. A judge ruled that her trust fund be used to save her family from bankruptcy. However, Foxworth claimed that this wasn't true. She said, Although her family was almost completely broke, they never filed for bankruptcy. In December of 2008, she became pregnant with her first child with her longtime boyfriend, Michael Shaw. Foxworth gave birth to her son on May 29, 2009. She appeared on Celebrity Rehab with Dr. Drew, The Tyra Banks Show, Oprah Winfrey's Show, 2020, and more later in life. Although she's not doing much now, she does share her life on Instagram from time to time. You know, I just wish that more people had compassion and empathy when it comes to younger stars and celebrities because first of all we we're all human second of all you never know what that person is going through you don't know a lot of the times these these kids are trying to live up to what people think that they're supposed to be or who they're supposed to be so a lot of these teenagers they're you know spending their money all crazy because they feel like that's how they're supposed to that's their image that's how they're supposed to come across 
Um, and then there's some that, you know, just because they were on the show for three years does not make them rich. So they still have to put on that facade of acting rich. So it's just, it's a lot of variables and levels to being a child star. And I just really wanted to just give my perspective on that because dragging some of these people, it's just not cool. 